Welcome to a new Let's Play with some of our mistakes. Hello and welcome back to the old stream farm where today we are using our latest acquisition, our Renault 13054. We've got it on the row crop wheels. We are going to be fertilizing our crops. We've got a dry day, which is a change just lately here on the old stream farm. But we will show you a bit of fertilizing not the newest of tractors but we are a small farm we haven't got much in the way of land really so we shall get this fertilizing done then we need to get the sprayer on because we've got spraying to do as well Put a minute fertilizing these potatoes fertilizer is in the yard we're not too far away from the yard at the moment so we should be able to run to the yard to fetch our fertiliser going whilst we're doing it today fields further away we may have to load them up onto the trailer but, uh, as always we will work the day out to Hopefully not be too many days showing you fertiliser spreading here on Old Strange Farm. We are on to Tuesday the 20th of May. A little wide there I think. A better setting. Sure, don't think we're going to quite finish this field with this one tank we've got on here at the minute. And now we're getting some rain again. So, uh, may have to get some animal work done. Probably buy some more beef cattle. We will finish this tank off now, we're in the field. really does seem to be miserable weather we're getting around here 15% of our fertilizer left so we should almost finish fertilizing the potatoes before we have to leave and fill up Now we shall head into the yard, take our tractor and get it filled up. We will go and check our animals, see how they're doing, seeing as it is raining. We do need to get our tractor undercover a little yeah this is the tractor we bought the other day and it is fined up again so that rain shower didn't last too long we shall go get some fertilizer spreading done 
we was going to check on the animals, but we will at the minute whilst it's fine. Get some more of the fertilizer spreading done. Drop our tank down and fill up. And we shall now head into the next field. Just through this little gateway at the side of the shed. And we shall now head around the outside, do the headlands first. None of the crops are through yet, so, and here comes the rain again. This, you'd think it was April with the April showers. We have got a bit of the crop here which is coming through. And it is a little bit dull as well today. Very much a dull, cloudy day. now know why we skip the night because there's no sleep trigger on here we went up to I so yeah we will continue fertilizing the field it is a little dark 20 to 10 at night and it is raining We'll also have to get ourselves sorted with this. We'll have to remember to switch the time back down again. get around and get as much of this done as we can. Did make a bit of a mistake. We shall have a jump cut and join you back in the next game day. Okay, we've had our jump cut. We've got through now to day one of summer, Wednesday the 12th of June. We need to get this fertilizing finished so we can get some grass mown. Need to make some hay or silage or whatever we need to make for the cattle. They are beef cattle we've got on here. So that. These narrow tyres on this tractor work well. This is now the big tractor on the farm. It also does the spray work because it's the only one we've got the row crops for. ourselves around down this headland. There's our buffalo in the yard. Ready for making buffalo burgers. Have to keep checking them every now and again. Don't need to put any straw into them now. They're spending most of the time outside, and so that will now hiding behind the trees a little here, but uh, there. That's all down this next line. 
just got it working, that's good. It's 25 past 7 in the morning, the animals have all been fed. Not sure how long we're going to have to keep them before they are ready to go to market. Hopefully we can make some good money once they do go over to the market. As always, struggling to see where we've actually fertilised and where we haven't. It doesn't do as big a breed as you think, I don't think. I'll get some fertilising done next time you join us we shall have the two wheel drive 751 on our grass mower and we are missing some seem to be missing a breed each time we come but not going anywhere near as much as we first think now we shall get closer, keep it up. We have got a grass field just up the road which we purchased, so that's giving us plenty of grass to mow. And so we need to get this fertilising done, we need to get some spraying done. Could do with getting a bigger fertilizer spreader as well going forward, which we could afford at the minute, I think. So we could actually pop this down and once it's empty and buy ourselves a bigger machine. Not too far to go to the shop, trade this in. through this field, although there's some we've missed at the top, which we would ideally go back to. Down to 7% of our fertiliser left. We do probably Filling it up another 10%, 20%, whatever, to finish this field. So we'll trade in the fertilizer spreader in. That will now do that. We will nip to the shop, buy a new spreader. Find the second hand tractors means that it is a little bit on the worn side but, uh, we shall go and see what fertilizer spreader we can trade this in for that straw blower is there it won't be used now until late autumn when the cattle come in doors all the time we shall head off now pick up a bigger fertilizer spinner and possibly do we get in a bigger sprayer as well the one we've got is a little on the small side car coming we'll wait for him and away we go Good few people walking about this morning. Now 
this tractor a little bit quicker on the road as well than what the 751s are for popping to the shop. this road down and around a lot of traffic with rush hour 10 to 8 in the morning so I suppose the majority of that traffic is heading to the shops to start work and to the offices there's the animal dealer that's where our buffalo will come sold for the meat trade and we shall purchase some more we may actually purchase some more before those are ready for the market as I said before this is a John Deere dealership it's just they had this come in on PX for a new tractor so we decided we would buy it let's have a look now and see what fertilizer spreader we can get we can get the Amazon Zan at 15,000 have a cover on it yes it will hold 1500 litres 2500 litres will be good but we will go with 1500 and a cover on it 18,000 pounds we shall buy that and back to the garage and we shall sell no not that no that one the IMT nearly 2000 We can now hook up to the Amazon, which will be better for us going forward. And back to the farm we go, we shall fill this up, get into the next field. video you've seen two days of work in one but not to worry we shall head back fill this up we've got the field that we will pass on our right hand side shortly to get fertilised turn right here and then follow the road round we've also got two fields one up near the shop two fairly big fields to get fertilised also need to get a sprayer on, get filled up with chemical. And here is the field to our right hand side here now which needs fertilising. We shall pop into the yard, get ourselves filled up buffalo there walking about in the field and 
There is a local farmer who takes his male buffalo to the soul point. When they're young, they uh, taken there to be sold for people to buy to fatten up. Now we shall go around get these fields done fairly quickly. Time we've been around the outside of this field, it will be finished, I think. Only one breed left. No, nope, that is going to be finished. Now we need to go back up towards the shop. We are 84% full, so we should. Yeah, we've got enough room to get out before any cars come. We shall head down to the next field. Our potato crop is now through as well, which is good. We shall turn left here, follow the road down. Which will lead us to our uh, next field. We shall be recording for about another five minutes to get things done. Yeah, it's a bit of a Bit of a mess up at the minute. This one we left the time on 120 after we'd skipped them through the night because we haven't got a sleep trigger. Forgot to change it back. And so here we are into the next field. Fairly big field to get into. with putting that piece of ground there into the field as well ready for the next growing season you cover a good bit of ground each breed with this we will finish this field in this video time you join us will be on the second day of summer and hopefully we should be able to get some grass mowing uh, we shall see how that works going forward we may actually be spraying as well We are now almost back to the headland, there we go. Now getting through this fertilising pretty quickly. Good job we've got this fertiliser spreader, it really does speed the process up. We'll have to check the weather going forward as well because if it is going to be nice and warm then we need to get the aid on. Now we need to head over to the last of our fields to be done. Whilst we do 
that is where we're going to leave you for today. So, I hope you've enjoyed this episode on the old stream farm. Please give us a like, give us a share, drop us a comment. If you're new to Summer Farm Estates and you'd like to see more of the work we do here, please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, it will tell you when we do these videos, when we do our live streams, until you join us next time, thank you very much for watching, and goodbye for now.